three. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a Christmas collaboration video hosted by Jessica from Measure and Mix and Antoinette from Simple Yet Chic. So today's video is a DIY Christmas centerpiece challenge and we are to create a DIY centerpiece and use it within our Christmas decor. So I want you guys to go ahead and check out their channels. Make sure you subscribe to their channels. There will be a playlist um, link in the description box below of all the wonderful ladies that are going to participate. Make sure to go to uh, Measure and Mix, which is Jessica's channel, and Antoinette's channel, which is Simply Yet Chic, and subscribe to their channels, watch their videos, and let them know that I sent you over there. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So in this uh, challenge, you're going to need a wreath of your choice. Also some fake snow. I picked these snow up from the dollar store and they were, of course, a dollar a piece. You're also going to need some fake uh, Christmas trees. You can get them in Walmart for really, really inexpensive um, price and also you know, some homes or a truck, whatever it is that you desire to use. I got these from um, the Salvation Army and they were 99 cents a piece. You're also going to need a canister. I picked this up at Walmart. I had it for, for a very long time and I picked it up for $11.99 at Walmart. So here you see I am just flocking my um, my wreath, just kind of fluffing it up a little bit. Um, I want it to give off the idea of it being, the homes being surrounded by, by pine trees and snow, almost like a winter wonderland theme um, or scenery, if you will. So I'm going to go ahead and just fluff up the, the stems to make them look like pine trees. You want to make sure that you fluff them up really good, you guys, because you want the stems to um, kind of be, be standing straight up to really, really mimic that feeling of pine trees and snow um, all around or on the trees. Um, so you really want to make sure that you fluff up your wreath a lot. Um, so here I am just putting the canister in the center of the wreath. This project is so simple, it's so easy, and it's really so chic. <laughs> So here I am just putting um, the snow inside of the canister itself. This snow was a little bit difficult to work with. It was the first time that I've ever worked with um, fake snow. And this one was um, like a styrofoam type, you know, filling. And it was very difficult to work with because it was so light. And you will see throughout the video, I was kind of having a little bit of difficulty with it because the the houses they are so heavy and the snow um is so light and so the homes they kind of were sinking through the snow so instead of them sitting on top of the snow they were sinking and the snow was sort of uh overflowing or overtaking them so i don't think i will ever work with the snow again if you guys know of any better uh faux snow leave a comment down below and let me know uh, because this one wasn't wasn't my favorite at all and I don't think that I'll ever work with this again So I'm just kind of just, you know, fooling around with it and and seeing uh, where I can put all my trees and my houses. 
Um, so I am no longer going to be talking through this video because it's sort of self-explanatory. Um, but I definitely want you guys to go out and check out Measure and Mix and Simple Yet Chic, Jessica and Antoinette's channels. As you can see, I broke my scissors. <laughs> um, and, you know, watch their videos and subscribe to their channels. They are awesome and creative women. Let me tell you, they do a lot of DIYs and home decors and home decor tours, a lot of haul videos, and they are so talented and so creative. Um, I've been watching them now for a very long time, um, and I absolutely love, love, love what they do and how creative and talented they really are. And so I want you guys to also check the playlist. Uh, there's going to be some wonderful and creative women that's going to be taking part in this collaboration. Um, so go ahead and subscribe to their channels as well. Visit them, you know, interact with them. And um, yeah, let them send them some love and let them know that uh, I sent you guys over as well to their channels. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like this type of DIY videos, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and also press that bell for new video notifications and also interact with me, you guys. You know that that's one of my favorite things is to interact with you guys. So leave your comments down below and I definitely will get back to you guys. Um, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Merry Christmas. Enjoy the video. Jesus loves you. I love you, and I'll see you next time. Thanks, guys. Bye. Christmas, all the happy smiles and the wishes, and I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. Tell me one thing is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. Whatever we do, we will be alright These holiday wonders will open your mind May all your wishes tonight come true The love I live, the dream I knew This Christmas I only wanna be close to you Magical time full of kisses Take a walk outside and tickle the snowman's nose Moving nimbly Did you hear 
something from the chimney I will keep you warm as soon as you remove 